Hey guys, good morning and welcome back. We are vlogging today because I have so much to do. <laughs> so much to do, so little time, and I thought I would go ahead and pick up my vlog camera. So I dropped Sydney off at school. It is um, a school day when I'm filming this, and of course heated up my morning coffee. So uh yeah so tomorrow is sydney's official actual official actual birthday on tuesday and she'll be home with me tomorrow and we'll be celebrating it just her and i um we celebrated with friends and family yesterday at a snow tubing place called seacoast adventure in windham maine if you guys are like from the area or local or anything it was so much fun I haven't had that much fun in a really long time, well, probably since Disney. Um, oh my word, I didn't vlog or bring my vlog camera at all. I will try to show like whatever clips or pictures that I got on my phone. I didn't get many because we were just in the moment, enjoying time, laughing, smiling, and like just enjoying life with friends and family, and it was the best. a little under an hour away from it definitely worth it like highly recommend it's so much fun we snow tube for a two hours so you have two hour time period and yeah fun for all ages just literally the best day like cupcakes and that my cousin made for her with little tiaras on them I don't, I don't I got like a picture <laughs> of so yeah so we did the whole birthday thing yesterday with friends and family like low-key outside and just so much fun um yeah so today on the agenda i have to mail off a couple of things that i sold on poshmark so i have to go ahead and like print those shipping labels and package those up and get those out i have to make a return i want to get balloons for sydney's birthday tomorrow um or maybe just one like i don't know she loves balloons and then i do have to get gift bags or wrapping paper to wrap Sydney's gifts that I got her. First and foremost though, I am going to go ahead and sit in front of my light while I like check some emails since it's Monday. Got to do the Monday things. I'm probably going to save my workout for later because I really need to make sure that I'm, I have enough time to get everything that I need done. Oh, and I have to, oh, I almost forgot. I have to pick up a grocery order just like an hour. I almost forgot. <laughs> us to do. Happy Monday. I just needed some produce really and just some odds and ends as far as groceries go. I needed some bread. We have everything bagels, some yogurts for Sydney, her little smoothie pouches that she loves. Uh, these are some of my favorite. I absolutely love these core bars and this one is peanut butter chocolate. These are my favorite. Uh, we have some turkey and cheese for lunches, some purple grapes over there, cucumber, avocado, red pepper, coffee creamer. I'm going to make Sydney some, well, and myself, um, some pasta salad this week for lunch for her. She likes that. So I have some Italian dressing, some Italian dressing, cheddar, sharp cheese, black olives to go in there. I'll put like the cucumbers and I have some tomatoes already at home. We have yellow onion, these pretzel goldfish for snacks, some strawberries, um, this is just a pizza dough that I'm going to pop in the freezer chest. 
and then some rotisserie chicken that I will use tonight with dinner. Oh, I did get some um, seltzer as well, some like raspberry lime seltzer. So while I was on my way to pick up my groceries, um, I ended up stopping at the post office to grab boxes. I always grab the priority mail, like envelopes and boxes and whatnot to have, and I did not have any to mail out some of my Poshmark items. Um, so that's what I'm gonna do now. I'm just gonna package these up and then run to the post office to mail them out. And then I do wanna go, I have to go to Target because I wanna find like balloons or something special for Sydney tomorrow, like a little, I don't know, I think balloons. So I thought I bought two of these, or not bought. I thought I got two of the big ones, but I guess I didn't. I accidentally got uh, the medium. So I will drop these off and then while I'm there, pick up another large one for this to mail out. Progress, we're making progress on the day. returning these snow pants. These are the ones that I decided not to keep. I will break like a twig right under your feet. Don't you say that you didn't want me. You turned me upside down and then you I'm in line to go get a coffee and I was just looking in the mirror I have so many gray hairs <laughs> wow anyway I dropped off all of my boxes um, at the post office and now I'm grabbing myself a coffee and we are gonna go to Target and Market Basket. I believe Market Basket has like a decent selection of say like cakes, cupcakes, ice cream cakes. I might try to see if I can get an ice cream cake because Sydney's had, she had cupcake with a friend on Saturday, like a big one. Um, and yesterday we had cupcakes with family and then tomorrow's her real birthday. And then on Wednesday, she, we're gonna bring something in for her class, like treats, whether it be cupcakes or cookies or something just to like celebrate her birthday um, because she's not in school on her actual birthday, you know? Yeah, so I think I'm gonna look for like an ice cream cake, something that we can have and it can be in the freezer and we can eat it over time. I think that's what I'm totally gonna do. And then, uh, 
go home. We have, I have exactly three hours from now until I have to pick Sydney up from school. It is gonna be snowing tonight, so it's already starting to flurry just a little bit. It is supposed to snow tonight. This is, I need to desperately wash my hair. Anyway, I'm excited. I'm excited for her birthday tomorrow. I'm just gonna chat with you while I'm sitting in line because apparently, I don't know. Um, I'm really excited for her birthday tomorrow because I haven't told her, but I'm gonna give her a yes day on her birthday. It is supposed to be raining all day, so we're a little bit limited, but I am gonna give her a yes day and we'll see what she decides to do. Uh-oh. There's no sweetener in there. I guess it's healthier. Hmm. As I was just complaining about uh, how much sugar we've had, the universe said, I got you. That's what just happened there. I had a feeling you'd come back and save me from all those lonely nights and heartbreaks. And I feel misplaced without you. Why don't we go back to, why don't we go back to, never wanted to end it like we did. I guess shit happens for a reason. But it's like something feels different from back then. Why don't we go back to, why don't we go back to, honestly I'm open wide. I don't feel like up without you by my side I still see your silhouette Why don't we go back to Why don't we go back to Your bedroom Alright, I'm home and I'm going to This battery is dead too My other battery is dead and I just Exchanged it for this one which I thought Was charged Alright, luckily I have three Because every time you get a new camera you get a new battery Don't mind, I have Folded laundry that I need to put away on my couch. Um, I was folding it this morning. Gift bag, that one was cute because it has animals and Sydney loves animals. I shared on Instagram, I went on like, I don't know, last Wednesday or something, I went to the local, a couple of local toy places and kids places and I got her these little butterfly wings. She loves to play dress up still, loves to be fancy and sparkly and glittery. Anything like fairy, princess, Glitter. She also, I mean, she loves dinosaurs. She loves dirt. She loves all that stuff too. Also got her these, the Big Gem diamond painting kit. I did get, I shared on YouTube, I did get her friend a kit of this for her birthday or Christmas or something. And so I ended up getting Sydney one. Um, a little like sparkly wand. It's just a couple bucks. A little like sparkle glitter wand that she can play dress up with as well. And then I got her a couple of books. Um, hmm, I haven't decided. There's one that I might save for the next holiday. <laughs> um, this one is called This is a Moose and I just thought it was cute. It was in like the little main section of our local, oh, wait, this store is, I'm obsessed with it. They have a website, it's called Day Trip Society. It's the Day Trip Junior, which is like the kids one. If I had a kids shop, it would be that. It's all boutique, super, super cute, wooden, I mean, it's it's expensive. <laughs> if I had a store, it would be that because I love everything there. Um, but anyway, I got her a new book for us to read and then her little like snow, uh, snow sled thing and I took her snow tubing yesterday and then like I had quickly mentioned tomorrow for her birthday I'm gonna give her a yes day and see what she wants to do whether we go to like the trampoline park go to the movies stay home I don't know what she's gonna choose to do um so we'll see so we're gonna like have a really fun girls day tomorrow um I did get her this dress and I figured she could wear it tomorrow she would probably want to I'm gonna wash it tonight or like right now um but i got this at target it's just like a i don't know i thought it would be perfect for a little birthday dress um it has the little like tutu frills pink gold glitter stars on it long sleeves so she can also wear this to um school as well with like pants underneath or whatnot but i thought she would totally love that i said wow that would be a perfect birthday dress for sydney because that's all she wants to wear 
our dresses. That's all she wants to wear. Um, I had to get some Valentine's cards for her class. Tights to go with the dress. Um, also, for Valentine's Day, her birthday is February 8th. I don't do a Valentine's basket. <laughs> I think whatever I would put in Valentine's basket would be the same as like the other basket. Um, but anyway, so I'll just do like this little chocolate hearts and then maybe like a little stuffed animal or something for Valentine's Day. Uh, let me know though in below if you guys do something special for Valentine's Day. I see a lot of influencers creating super cute like Valentine's basket themes balloons because we have to have balloons for her birthday i got her a number five balloon we'll probably take a picture it's like a tradition every year she you know has the picture next to the number <laughs> i want i already looked at last year's the number four which i really liked the 3d number four with the balloons in it that i did and she's changed so much already from just last year i did get her a pair of pajamas which i'm gonna save um I'm gonna save um, but these were cute and I thought I would snag them while I could because she's I feel like her sizes go really fast now I don't I don't know I just feel like they never have her size so I grabbed it while I could 5t this is Burt's bees pajamas um, they just have little animals on them um, little like horses cows chickens little goats pigs and all of that um but those will be perfect springtime pajamas so those are gonna stay here uh and i'll share later what i don't know why i'm even thinking about april already but i am is that what I, and then i got her that little ice cream cake um and i thought that would be perfect since we've had so much actual cake and cupcakes and all of that i just figured it would be a nice little change of course, a little number five candle. Wow, you can't see anything. A little number five candle and then tissue. And she'll wanna wear it, I already know. She's gonna gasp and say, oh, I'm gonna look fabulous. And then I have to go out and do some shoveling because it snowed a few days ago at this point and it was super weird. It was, it, it like snowed a little bit but then it was sleeting all day and so the snow slash ice was like shoveling sugar and then it all froze and so you couldn't shovel it um so my driveway and my walkway is a hot mess and the association they're like trying the people who the association hires to plow um but i just need to like just go do it myself type of thing I still see your silhouette. Why don't 